So, we learn how much time for the guy Rus and Yankees. Bad girls, man. So, this anime, I love it, right? Last episode, hilarious. I love the whole thing that he's like childhood best friend, love interest, right? His girlfriend goes turned into a guy Ru. <laughs> Kuru girl. She became a Kuru girl and effed around and slept with everyone. Yeah, I mean, it's like, yeah, it's the dumbest thing ever. Uh, it is so pure, like a hentai bait or whatever. Yeah, Jesus Christ. But. I think it's really fun, uh, but no one else cares. This, this this show is tracking so poorly. Um, so I don't know, guys. I feel I might. There's something I want to experiment with on the channel. I'm thinking. I haven't done it yet. But it is maybe doing reactions on membership, right? Because I think that if you do membership, you can actually use a little bit more of you know, showing and so on. Yeah, you can do a little more risky, a little more editing, so to speak. So I'm, 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 I'm thinking of perhaps moving these kind of reactions or reviews or whatever, right? to uh, membership and uh, something like that i also been thinking for a long time i hope to do the same thing they have manga reads on membership right so i can show the panels so a little bit at least a little bit so i'm a little bit yeah this feels like an anime that I, I might try doing that next week so this might be the last episode i do here on the it depends on how it goes right but i, I feel that uh, it's a bit interesting change here it's not that or you know maybe put some other uh some more platform but i'm thinking that it could be interesting um because it does have to feel like an anime where a few people, right, they really enjoy my reaction to this anime, but it's only like five people. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> it's like me and four other five people in the whole universe. They really care about this. But the thing is, I have a face in this anime. It's like, you know, but, 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 but to be fair, right? I love this anime. I love it. I love this anime. It's freaking Yankee guy. I love this anime. But obviously, I'm fully aware that this is not the best anime this season, right? You know, I don't think it's bad, but I'm, I'm fully aware that. This anime, I'm very biased, right? Because every character is a god, it's a gal horror, right? Yeah, it's a gal horror. So obviously, I'm like, oh my god, this is the ultimate dream for me, right? So, I don't know. I do personally feel like my videos are, are I think, good, right? Because you won't find another person on the internet that actually cast this much about like Gairu Horror and Yankee Show, right? So, <laughs> so, I love it, right? But I can understand why so few other people care about it. So, it also might be a better editor show where, let's say, I edit, you know, my favorite scenes of 10 episodes, discuss it, right? Because I do also feel that it has a cultural value, right, to speak. Cause, you know, I like to talk about, like, Gyrus, Yankees, so on, right? the clothing, the fashion, this anime or manga, and then, you know, it has some interesting stuff, right? For example, um, earlier speak, I read, you know, my, I'm in love with, like, a slutty Gyru, yeah. <laughs> I'm in love with the Gyru slut, yeah. That, that, that manga, the title is alone, it's like, what is it, um... I mean, I, I'm in love with this slutty gal, yeah, <laughs> I'm in love with slutty gal. Uh, it's always has a lot of interesting of this, uh, I'm interested in this kind of, you know, the whole subculture, right? So in that sense, I, I also feel like, I, I, in a way, I'd rather do a video going over this this different episode, discussing, like, you know, cultural norms or whatever, like clothing and so on, yeah, I don't know. Uh, I'm, I'm a spitballing guys. Let me comment what you guys think. Uh, we'll see, but... Yeah, did they even do a normal reaction and maybe next week or something else? I don't know, because I feel, I feel this anime is really hilarious, right? It really, oh yeah, but but again, I understand that no one else really cares about it, you know, except the very few people that are really into it, right? So, maybe another approach would be better if we discuss some different angles, so to speak, there, right? But anyway, so 3, 2, 1, and go. But I do feel this anime might be, yeah, more fitting for... Um, like now he's like you know in, in the bedroom with this uh, with this guy Ru. yeah he's in the bedroom here with the horny guy Ru. she wants some yeah she's hungry yeah she's like let's do it boy yeah <laughs> and they're all like hunting his uh, penis man <laughs> straight up yeah all the guy Ru's are like let's fuck <laughs> yes yeah so she's of course eats chips and so on yeah yeah because you know she's like uh yeah, she's really thirsty. Yeah, she's thirsty, man. She is horny, man. She wants some. Yeah, she wants some. I mean, it's like the whole show is like a bunch of guy react because they want to sleep with him. I mean, but now it's not she feeds him uh, cookies. But this wife will bring cookies, though. This wife will bring cookies, guys. She's a very good wife. Yeah, she bring cookies. <laughs> she's bringing the cookies. Oh, now she's gonna follow him around. <laughs> he got like a guy who's stalker. Okay, opening, yeah. She's like, <laughs> after him in like a at school. <laughs> he gets a guy who's stalker, of course, yeah. Because they're all in love with him. They're all like, I mean, you curse to be in love with him, right? The guy, he, 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 can, he curses them, so everyone wants to smash with him, you know what I mean? They're all like, oh, yeah. He said, meshes now. 
Yes, we're doing the open twenty. Doing open, I can look at my phone or something. Uh, but yeah, he's um, they're all cursed to be in love with him. I also like to see how she's like a very powerful fighter, but past him she can't. She had like produced any power. She's like, oh, it's a cute guy. Like losing out her power when she not touches him. Yeah, it's like, no, I can't do it. Uh. Hmm. I'm working on this art piece that I'm trying to kind of perfect. I'm thinking about it. Hmm. I have an idea here. Mm hmm. Yeah, we are opening over. Well, that's a cute girl as well. I like this girl, man. She's the poor, the normal girl. She's the only non guy in the whole class. Yeah, me neither! She's going all cute now. This guy's like, what's happening? Why is she cute for? Why is she acting all adorable for? She's like a murderer. Yeah, she's like, shut up, bitch. She <laughs> left her after the door. She spits on her, like, get away. Yeah. She used to be this, uh, you know, yeah, badass fight chick, right? The delinquent. Yeah, and now she's all like, uh, oh, come on, yee. So, uh, everyone in the court is very confused why she's so, uh, come on, right? But yeah, look, I love this girl. Like the normal girl, you know? The only woman in the class, yeah, the only woman in the class is like a normal person. There isn't like crazy guy or a Yankee or a martial artist of sort. So he got three girlfriends now in this class, uh, yeah. He got three, three, uh, thirsty guy, Rus. Okay. Gives a speech about flowers and so on. He really reminds me of Kenichi in a sense. Yeah, Kenichi is like, please stop fighting me. I just want to have a, you know, a flower garden. <laughs> yeah, leave me alone, you bastard. You guys like it? <laughs> basic. These poor guys are like, yeah, that was pretty decent. That was like... <laughs> she looks at him like she's gonna cry. Oh, it's so beautiful! <laughs> she looks at him like it's the greatest thing ever. Yeah, no, she's gonna watch. I mean, that guy looks exactly like the guy from Tokyo Revengers. Yeah, with the hair, the bullet, and the glasses. It's exactly like one of the guys in Tokyo Revengers, straight up. Hi! She needs to him though. I'm an awesome dude! <laughs> yeah, she's so used to her not following the rules. Oh, she's following the rules now? Yeah, she's like, all the girls are like, I will read! <laughs> she's so, she's afraid I'm gonna beat her up as so, well, yeah. Oh, you're gonna work on the flowers with him? Yeah, like, just understand. Okay, I like it, yeah. Now all the guy chicks are like, yeah, let's make a flower garden. Yeah, they're all like, yeah, let's make a cute little like, flower garden here. We're gonna... <laughs> she doesn't understand anything was happening. She's like, what? Why are they all so nice for? Why are they... Yeah, I also want to make a garden. Yeah, they're all super into it. His power of the, the women, man. His power over his ladies. He makes them all adorable. Yeah, he's making them all turn into like uh, proper ladies now. They're not, not breaking the laws anymore. The, the, you know, working on the flowers, yeah, they're like, <laughs> documenting, they're big, <laughs> yeah, it's so stupid. They all these, like, delinquent chicks with, like, you know, roughed up clothing, crazy hairstyles, tattoos, and this, they're all <laughs> working on the flowers, yeah, they're all like, yeah, look at the garden, yeah! <laughs> He's like, he's pacifying all the, yeah, all the delinquents are being pacified by him, yeah. This one guy is like, what the F is happening, man? What's happening with those guys, man? With the booming tough guys, yeah, we're like the bro... He's making all, all the criminal, all the criminal youngsters, all the juvenile, juvenile delinquents. He's turning them all into a little botanist. Oh, it's adorable, man. It's adorable, sitting, the whole gang sitting there with their, like, weapons, like... Yeah, like these guy who shakes right there, yeah, they're all caring about this thing now. <laughs> yeah, like the worst school in the pan, man. He's similar, I mean, one of my all-time favorite shows, right, is called Grand Teacher on Iska, right? Which I think is one of the greatest shows ever done. He reminds me of that, how GTO on Iska then goes into school, right, beats the, kid, he beats the kids up and then makes them become good kids, yeah. One of my all-time favorite animates of all time, right? He's like, I love it so much. Get an image of GTO, man. I love it so much. It's like, I have the whole the manga. I have even the younger years too. I have the younger before he's 
it is always going to be one of my all time favorite, you know, anime manga at GTU. Uh, but I did my, my X3X9 thing right uh, a few years ago. I was just saying that you know, GTU is one of my all time favorite and most important manga animes ever, right? It's just an incredibly important thing to because it's kind of the first, I, I would argue for it, it's the first manga to, to really popularize or you know, popularized the, yeah, the delinquent, you know, I think he's like the first manga to really have the Yankees and so on. Uh, he's always gonna be my, he's my boy, man. Oniska, that's like my role model. Uh, when I was a teacher, I was like, call me grand teacher, great teacher, Myrmonden! That's like, yeah, I was like, great teacher, Myrmonden, that's what you address me as, kids. But yeah, I mean, this is... Nani! She's all like, I like being cute! Yeah, but isn't it weird? Like, why do you care about like pottery and like? Nani, I, I like it. I like that stuff. <laughs> yeah, he's only gonna be like, what the fuck is happening? He's the only one that is like, this is really weird. You used to beat the crap out of people. You used to punch people in the face. You used to be like the most violent girl that existed. He's just like, oh, but I like flowers now. It's like, no, you don't. No, you don't. It's like, stop being all adorable. Yeah, no. This poor guy though, he might be lover, right? Hmm. Roku Dorto. Now he's like, Roku Do. I need to kill that guy. Hmm. Yeah. But that this guy might love her, right? Yeah. He might he, he might be in love with her. I mean, her normal self, right? Before everything started. So he might be like, what? This guy is stealing my girlfriend? Not only is he stealing my girlfriend, he's also making her into like a cutie little, uh, you know, flower girl. Instead of being a brutal martial. She was like a martial artist, right? Yeah. She was like a delinquent Sukuban girl, passing people on the street, right? And now, now, now she's all like, you know, oh yeah, let's pick a flower, oh, let's plant the seeds, right? She's like, what's F is happening? But yeah, she's very adorable, episode. Yeah, he's really pacifying her. She's turning into, from a Sukuban into a little kawaii, little flower girl, a Yamato. Yeah, a little... Uh These guys are like, wow, your powers are pretty effective, man. Yeah, she... She was the most violent little bastard ever. Now she's like adorable. Okay. Uh, something might happen to her now though. Yeah. They might beat her up. This guy might beat her up something. No. Yeah. He did. Oh no. He destroyed the flowers. <laughs> and now they're all like. Kick your ass. <laughs> they're all Yankees. Right? They're all Yankee Yankees. Guy. Now he's like. Murder. <laughs> <laughs> now they all reverted. It's clearly his fault. It's clearly he, 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 he did. But yeah, now they all immediately revert back to like their, you know, their Yankee ways. Yeah, someone destroys their, yeah, their, their flowers. Someone destroys the Yakuza's like little flower bed. Basically, it's like war. <laughs> yeah. We're gonna kill everyone. Yeah, now now it's like yes, we we she's gonna turn into a violent monster again because. Yeah, they destroyed her poor little flowers. Yeah, now it's like, I will kill them all. Yeah, now she's turning into a complete murderous seer killer again here. Uh, <laughs> someone's setting her flowers, yeah, it's like... Uh, but it's clearly his fault, man, he's lying to them, yeah, probably. He comes to and he's gonna realize that everyone's been defeated, yeah, everyone's beaten up here. And she's so tiny though. Yeah, it's weird how short she is. But she's his, his age. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, she's just very short, right? It is a little weird, you know. Yeah, she's one of those characters. Like, why is she, like, so short for? She's, like, probably his. He's probably older than the main character. But yeah, this is gonna turn into a fight. No, she's a nice person. He's like, I, I believe in you. You can be redeemed. You can be a pacifist. Yeah. Pacifying the the delinquent girl. Straight up, man. Yeah, he's like she's fighting through her. Uh... This is cute though. Like, she, she gets so triggered by the flowers. Yeah, yeah. It should have turned into a monster when it ruined the flowers. Yeah, you ruined my little garden. Everyone has to die now. Everyone will burn in hell. <laughs> Basically, yeah. She's just like, everyone shall die. Yeah, it's like okay. Oh my god, this is kind of sad now though. She's like sad, crying, angry. Yeah, this is kind of a sad face here. 
Yeah, a little combination of. Yeah, that's like a sad face still. Here we go. Yeah, you have to go to the uh, gang, right? <laughs> but I mean, it's like, it really reminds me of Kenichi, another great anime, you know, one of all the famous animes where he's just trying to be like a flower guy. Kenichi just wants, he's supposed to have a little garden, right? And he gets into fights all the time. So they have to, like, he has to learn the martial art to defend himself uh, because he's a nerdy flower guy. And then he kept trying to ruin his garden, so he beats him up and so on. Yeah, it's a part of Kunichi in the beginning when he has a garden in school and the karate guy is like, I will burn your garden down. So he has to beat him up to defend his flowers, yeah. He's like, leave my garden alone, you bastards. He's like, leave my garden flowers alone, man. But here she is, yeah, she's pissed off. Oh, you got like a brass knuckle here, yeah. <laughs> Just lace him in the face! Uh, <laughs> yeah, for some reason she's really short, but she's like the most violent little girl ever. But she's not even a girl, she's most. <laughs> this is awesome! She's like straight, like that's the woman I love! Because he's loving her, isn't he, right? Come on. He's just like, that's my captain! Yes! <laughs> she's, the, she's like the most the violent girl ever! <laughs> he jumps up and knees him and peace off ever up by himself! And then her. Whatever it is, her, her like her like right hand guy is like yeah, yeah. He's just like that's the woman I love, yeah. Oh my god, yeah. He takes her to the the other, you know, Yakuza gang or whatever. <laughs> they destroy my flowers. Um, but you know, if someone throws your flowers, right? They, they gotta resolve it with the fist, right? Yeah, that's how they live. She, she understands. The other Yankee girl, she's like, oh, I understand, though. She, you know, she's a movement of the fist, right? She can only communicate with fisting people, so, you know. And I don't mean in the sexual way, because I mean punching people, right? Why is that special? I hate it, man. When I was a kid, we would say, you know, your fist would be like, you know, basically like, punch. Yeah, not just punching, but... Where I'm from, it's kind of like if you fist it, it's like, you know, you have to communicate with your punch, right? That's what that means to me, at least, right? And now internet has destroyed this word for me, because when I grew up, when we said a phrase in Swedish, that was like with your knytnäven. Yeah, in Swedish, uh, it means more like I, the fist thing. Yeah, it's like knytnäven. It's like knytnäven. It's like I talk with my punch, you know, I'm talking by my power, yeah. In Swedish, it's a Swedish idiom, okay, I'm translating for Swedish. In a Swedish idiom, it basically is like, I communicate by the power of my fist right there. Basically, like, I can't talk to people, I just punch them. I only communicate by violence, basically. But yeah, she's just gonna, here is the course. No, you're a flower girl! Yeah, it's like, no, I'm gonna pacify her. She's part of my flower girls now. Rock and roll! Yeah. He's a nice guy after all, he got with the, yeah, he's coping in with the flowers. He needs to work his farm, you know, yeah, he needs to seduce her, right, you know. It's gonna work, man, she's gonna fall in love with him again, when she's in love with him anyway, but I mean, even more so, I mean. I guess he will genuinely, I guess the difference would be that she's like magically in love with him, right, uh, episode 2. But now here, she's gonna be like actually in love with him, right, she's gonna fall in love with him. You know, from a, like an actual, yeah, romantical standpoint, by his behavior rather, right? But of course, he brings his girlfriend to protect him, right? Yeah, I guess so. But it would happen. But I think someone, yeah, there she goes. Yeah, I mean, exactly. So suddenly, <laughs> he bought a beast with him. Yeah, because he didn't know what was happening. We didn't see it, but yeah, he's, <laughs> he brought, he brought his, he brought his girlfriend with him. You're like, what is happening? The woman is the strongest thing ever. Yeah, they brought, he brought his beast girlfriend with him. Exactly. He can read, uh, he can read his book there because his super aggressive uh, girlfriend is there to beat the crap out of everyone. <laughs> this is my last anime. He's reading the book and she's just like brawling with everyone in front of him. Yeah, she's taking down the whole gang by herself while he's reading the book. It's not even a point for him to read the book, man. It's not, it doesn't even add anything. I know she's gonna help him, right? Probably. No? He actually got him, man. Yeah, okay. I thought she was gonna jump in and help her. It helped. Okay, this woman, yeah, okay. She got a shamed her. Got a little more experience, a little more, a little more seasoned the bad guy, okay.
But yeah, I, 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 this is beautiful, by the way. <laughs> He's like, I brought my girlfriend with me. <laughs> yeah, she will defend me when I read books, but. He's basically casting a spell on her, yeah. But I mean, he's getting beaten up now, but I, I'm assuming she's gonna come and save him, right? Yeah, she's probably gonna come in there and save him. And, you know, see him getting punched. I'm surprised she hasn't done it yet, honestly, but at any moment now, she's probably gonna jump in and beat him up, right? Yeah, like being punched by this guy, he's been saucer now. Yeah, but I mean, yeah, she's just standing there, okay, confused. He's pacifying the delinquent girl, yeah, it's, it's hard work, man, with the father goes to But I mean, she's gonna come and save him, uh, probably, right? The, I, can't, I can't see it going any other way, really. Maybe the other guy will realize that he has to, I don't know, she's happier as like a flower girl or something, I don't know, but uh, unlikely. Yeah, well, he kind of let him go past him, though, I suppose, but... Hmm. He did do that, yeah. 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 Hmm. <laughs> it's adorable though, yeah. She's all like, oh, rock and roll! <laughs> His face is all again in this episode. <laughs> His face is all, yeah. Oh, rock and roll! <laughs> My hero! <laughs> His face is like a million beast things, yeah. This guy don't listen to the weirdo man, don't listen to him. He don't listen to him, the weirdo. He's just ugly, yeah. Ignore him, ignore him. He's just a weird guy with magic powers, ignore him. <laughs> oh, he looks so ugly, man, his, his face, man. But yeah, she's. Pacified now. He's pacified the uh, the bad girl. He, the, he he his whole anime is him turning in the bad girls into good girls. Yeah, the whole anime is him like turning the bad girls into cute little good girls. So now she's gonna save him probably from the iron pipe here. Yeah, now she is gonna save him. Oh, she did it? No, no, she no. It's gonna be her saving. Yeah, exactly. Now she's gonna step in there and save him. Exactly. Yeah. Probably even hurt her. She's like a, she's like a superhuman too. Yeah, she he is there with an iron pipe, but it probably didn't hurt her because she's like a superhuman. Yeah, okay, but now he's gonna change his mind though because he he's clearly love with her. So now when he hit her instead, <laughs> he got another gang or more members. This anime, is, yeah, I got I got my crew. <laughs> this anime is crazy. He got more bikers. It's an anime world where everyone is a biker girl. Yeah, <laughs> it's like. Okay. What happened there? Oh, they're gonna be like gasoline plant or something. They got their ultimate strategy. I think so. Oh my god, there's something like that, yeah. They got the cement plan. <laughs> his face is completely it's from every episode, man. Oh yeah, of course he's there too, yeah, yeah. He's like his friendly friendly Yankee guy, yeah, he's there too, like yeah bros. I to care of the little on the side, man. Yeah, but now he's like, I can't run from this. Oh, is he gonna stand and fight for them? I think he's gonna sacrifice himself. Yeah, he's gonna like run, girl. I love you. Yeah, he's gonna stand there and he's gonna defend her, right? Yeah, he's gonna, he's gonna, because he's like, he's obviously guilt now and he threw the iron pipe, right? He obviously loves her, so clearly. He's in love with her. He's like, his badass fight girlfriend, right? Yeah, he's so clearly in love with her. Yeah, so he's just like, no, I gotta, you know, I gotta rid them, redeem myself right? he, with the iron pipe. Yeah, so he's gonna say and fight them, right? <laughs> By himself. Yeah, so he's gonna stand there and fight them so he can escape, right? Yeah. I know she's all happy here again. <laughs> but this is the yeah, so weird. That is honestly, I hate it. <laughs> like, we have all this, you know. We have all this. Uh, yeah, the delinquent girl. He's, he's making them all super wholesome and he, he's pacifying all this, like, bad chicks. 
he's making them go from badass to he's the wholesome garden, wholesome flower girls. Yeah, he, he's making the Tifa turn into Eric. Yeah, I don't know if I like it actually that he's making her like. I mean, of course, she's happier now and he's helping her out of her darkness. I mean, obviously, I understand the storyline, but I'm a little bit like, do I want that? Do don't I rather want to follow him in his harem of bad chicks that are all mean to each other? I kind of want them all to be mean, <laughs> you know what I mean? I kind of want them all to be be bad people, or not bad, but you know what I mean, they call bad girls, you know what I mean? Like criminals, I guess, yeah. I want them all to be like, uh, you know, tiny, I don't know, delinquents that do like petty crime or something, but there's good people in deep in, deep inside your heart or something. Um, but nah, you just, yeah, she runs away here and all happy. <laughs> his face though, the enemy keeps showing his goddamn face. <laughs> It keeps showing his face all the time. It's the weirdest thing ever. But yeah, let's review it. Um, but yeah, when he saved her, when he hit them with iron pipe, he was clearly just gonna sacrifice him, save her. But it really cracked me up there in the middle. But everyone was just like, I go back to that. But everyone was just, all the bad boys that he's seen. This really cracked me up. This I love this one. It's funny. It's funny as hell though. This really cracked me up though. You know, you see all the all these like guy rules and like bad boys. Yeah, you see the guy you're like, yeah, clean up that. We're gonna do one. Yeah, you can see these like you know these like kind of criminal yakuza people. You know, all they got the. There's a guy around the far corner and so on, you know, all, yeah, all these like delinquent chicks, right, with crazy hairdos. It's like a blonde guy you can't see on the screen, right? It's more of a guy who's there, um, n next to the guy with brown hair, uh, on the left here, right? Yeah, it's like two more guy who's you can't see in this scene. Uh, the blonde guy and the blue-haired guy, I think, yeah, whatever, you know, they got crazy hairdos on, yeah. They're all like, oh, this is a flower work, interesting. <laughs> they all, no, but the funny is that, I mean, these girls, right, and the guys, too, the girls, right? You know, they're all like slutty guys. So yeah, they all have like you know terrible scores at school, right? They all, you know, they, they all have they're terrible. This is like the whole class, basically the worst class in Japan, right? You know, they all got terrible scoring, terrible thing, no nothing. So it's kind of adorable seeing these like really like, kind of yeah slutty guy chicks, you know, with all the weird tattoos and everything, being like, huh. This is a flower. <laughs> how does this work? You know, you see the dragging guy in the middle bit reading a book. Like, how? What does this kind of mean? How do you read? <laughs> yeah, I don't know, but I find it hilarious. And then we see the old, like, the the all the older chicks is behind, like, do this thing, do that thing. Yeah, they're all like very, you know, commandable, aggressive, uh, <laughs> so on. Oh, it was adorable, man. Yeah, but yeah, of course her. Ergo-ish boyfriend was disappointed in her turning in from a fighter chick into, yeah, into like a cute, adorable little wholesome lady. Honestly, personally, I said laughing earlier, but I mean kind of literally, it doesn't really, you know, jive with me in that sense, right? I'm not overly interested in seeing him meeting these bad girls and then start making them good people. I, I, I really is interesting, but of course I want to be likable first, for, first foremost, right? And I want these Yankee chicks, whatever, to be, you know, the Gairus to be good people, right? But I don't want him to, like, you know, Gairu unify them, what we call it, right? You know what I mean? I'm not interested to see him, like, he's like a, you know, a chick with blonde hair and tattoos, and him being like, oh no, but you can be a good girl again, and like removing the blonde hair, and, you know what I mean? Yeah, that, that's what I want, so it's a little weird, because I'd rather have her stay as a violent, you know, I'd rather have her stay as a completely violent monster girl, right? But be nice to him, and yeah, and see, and like, think about it, like, like, again, one of my favorite anime, right? Belzebub, you know? Belzebub, everyone is like a crazy fighter guy, right? And the ladies, too. So, for example, Aoi and her gang, right? Aoi, Nia-san, and so on, yeah. Nia, 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 and so on. Those girls are all like fighter chicks, right? They're all Sukuban, Yankee chicks, and they all fight, and they all have bookends in the chain, and so on, you know? Uh, but they're all nice people, right? But they're also very violent, right? Yeah, they're nice, violent. They basically, like, they grew up in this, like, violent neighborhood with all the guys being, you know, violent and assaulting them, and so on. So they also fight, right? So they mostly they mostly fight to beat up bad men, right? Yeah, uh, and that I'd rather see, right? But all the girls are still like, yeah, you wanna fight, you know? Yeah, I still wanna see all the girls being like, you c c come at me, bro. Yeah, I wanna see them to be that, right? But then they go away and like, oh yeah, whatever, he's a loser. Yeah, I, I wanna see them be that, right? Like be nice, you know? They're they're fighting because they're doing it for a good cause, right? Yeah, rather that, and this this a little bit honestly felt a little bit like they were moving away from that. 
And he's just kind of like making all the girls just be like nice now. Oh, you're, you're a guy, Ru, and you're, you're like a horny guy, Ru? Oh, whatever, you can be a doctor, you know. Yeah, I'm really interested in that. I'm, I'm, <laughs> I'd rather them have them all stay as complete, like, you know, crazy tanks or whatever, but they just like him. Yeah, I don't know. What do you guys think? Hmm. I don't know. The witness has. Anyway, guys, please subscribe, press the like button, and have a great day.